Hi, today I want to show you the voice input of my Android mobile phone. I am using the Android version 7.1.1. First, I want to show you the Google Assistant. You can activate it by holding the home button. I have already activated it, so if you do it the first time, you will see there is an agreement. You have to confirm and read it carefully because you will allow Google to do a lot of things. And each month, Google will send you an email and saying uh, what you have done, where you have been, and how many kilometers have you walked in that month, and how many hours you spent on uh, on a car you will give a lot of information away so be careful read the agreement and also the first time it will ask you to uh, train the system and uh, to understand your voice basically you have to say okay google a few times here's what i found on the web you can see as soon as i said the keyword then it will listen to me now let me demonstrate uh, some example to you. Okay, Google. Sydney today's weather. Today in Sydney, it'll be mostly cloudy with a forecast high of 70 and a low of 62. Currently it's 69 and cloudy. Okay, you can see uh, the phone can talk to you and you can ask a lot of questions just like uh, Alexa from Amazon. Okay, Google. How old is Bruce Lee? Bruce Lee was 32 years old when he died in 1973. So you can see it's quite uh, interesting. Now the problem is uh, for non-native English speaker, there is a problem that uh, the phone doesn't understand you every time. There's another way to do uh, audio input. Uh, if I go to uh, Google search, for example, and here is my keyboard, if I type on the keyboard, and you can see there is a Google voice typing. If I click on it, uh, there is nothing much happen. Uh, in this case, you won't be able to find the setting for the language. But if you go to the phone and enter search, select voice typing, from the keyboard. And now you can see tap to speak here, saying now I just deactivate the microphone so I can talk. And if you go look at here, the, this is one is the setting. And here's the language. So now you can see plenty of languages. And so for example, uh, and the, what I found interesting is even Chinese dialect is available here. I picked Cantonese here. And this is after I set that up. And interesting is uh, then you, you can do the voice typing here in the Google search. So this is a Google search, then now uh, I'm going to try Cantonese. Trung Quốc Sao Tô Bắc Kinh Sĩ Sĩ Trung Hòa Nhân Mạnh Công Hòa Quốc Tích Sao Tô So you can see, under, can understand, uh, and it's really uh, used the speech response to me. Uh, but if I make a longer sentence, it still can find the result, but sometimes it doesn't give me in a, a voice answer. I am going to try again. Bingo Seng Si Hai Chung Kok Sao Tau. Although it understood uh, my sentence, but it didn't give me the uh, voice answer. So if it's very easy to understand, then it will reply me in speech. 
Try again. 成龙几岁？成龙今年六十二岁。Interesting is the voice is saying sixty-two, and you can see the text is showing sixty-three. And I'm going to try the same thing with the Google Assistant before. 李小龙几岁？以下是来自维基百科的资讯。Now it didn't give me uh, the age of uh, Bruce Lee, but it only showing some information. So that's the difference between the assistant and the Google search with voice typing. One interesting uh, thing in here is uh, you can even mix the language and it still can understand. Taylor Swift, get go. 八公尺。See, you can see it did understand my English part and then the Cantonese part. 邓丽君图片。以下是一些符合搜寻条件的相片。Honestly, I I'm very impressed with the、uh, Google search voice input. And if it can understand Chinese Mandarin, that's okay. But、uh, even dialect Cantonese is working pretty well.、Uh, it's already built in. You can try it out、uh, with your own language.、Uh, maybe your language is in the list. The other one, the Google Assistant, you have to be a little bit careful because you have to agree、uh, a lot of things. So after you have seen the、uh, summary report、uh, in your email. Maybe you will regret. So be careful.、Uh, it looks a, a little bit scary. And I hope you find this video interesting. And try it out with your own language. If you like the video, please click on like. Thank you for watching. Bye.